these students from North Carolina High Point University have been charged after burying their two-day-old child in the backyard of the boyfriend's house. Report says on September 4 that the 21-year-old Olivia Billington confidentially gave birth to an infant boy in a dormitory room. And according to reports from their school, the couple failed to seek medical attention following the child's birth as he died two days later. Report says the father of the child, Alex Best, a 19-year-old, took the baby to his home in Herdell country on September 6 and went on to bury him in the backyard of his house. A report said authorities were informed when they received an alert about human remains at the 19-year-old home. The authorities searched the property and discovered the infant's baby dead and very smelling. They saw a box and a baby wrapped in a blanket put in a shallow grave and there have been no report of the cause of the death of the baby as it was ruled inconclusive. The couple have been cooperating with the investigation as they have been charged with felony concealment of death and the boyfriend Best has been released on a $10,000 bill while Billington surrendered more than two weeks after Best was arrested with her bill being set at $50,000 bills. Billington told herself in to the police on October 1st and was charged with felony concealment of debt. She is due back in court in November and police said they do not expect to file additional charges against the couple in connection with their son's debt. Billington LinkedIn profile revealed that she had enrolled in High Point University in 2018 to pursue a bachelor's degree in business administration. This would have been easily avoided if they both took the child to the hospital or if they both had an idea that they were going to be caught because I think they had no idea that they were going to be caught and that was why they gave birth to the child in the dormitory and they were trying to dismiss the child.